Hi, I'm Monty Roberts, and I've been 86 Would you believe it, after all these years, they're going to throw me out. I have not cut a cow. Now, for those of you around the world, cutting a cow means to sort a cow from the herd. I have not, not done that for at least 10 years. But the key today is that this is Chrome, and he has not done it for 10 years. So today we have scientific proof that a horse never forgets anything. I hope. I hope he can still cut a cow. That means to separate the cattle as you point them out and bring one individual out of the herd. But the working cow horse has been my life. They were my trainers early on, just as the Mustangs were. And the working cow horse to me is everything because they are able to rein, that is to say run, stop, turn, back up, slide like a character on the ground like this, and work a cow down the fence like you had to go catch one that was getting away in the field. And then also the cutting. So the working cow horse does all three phases. It has been my dream to, on my birthday, May the 14th, 1935, I was born. Today, I'm 86. I'm 86. And I'm going to ride a cutting horse. My cutting horse. I hope he still remembers what to do because he literally has not cut a cow for 10 years. What we have here is a small group of steers and um, we'll, we'll say that one has a bad eye and needs to be doctored or something. So we have to cut out that one and that's where the word cut came from. Cutting out to put somewhere else some need, some difference in the animal that you're cutting out or sorting. You could use the term sorting because you're sorting through your cattle. So I put them in here and we'll call that area back there the back fence and I'll try to push all of them away from the back fence like this and then let them sort themselves out like that, and that, and that. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I wanted to tell you that if you watch Chrome, it's incredible. It's a little bit like going to Disneyland and watching parents holding the hands of little children and they're going to ride on the next ride. And the children will be standing there jumping up and down. They're ready to go on the next ride. They're ready to go. And here comes the ride, the car that they're going to get in to ride. And you see them jumping up and down. Why? Because they want to go on the ride. My world is to cause the horse to want to do it. And we'll see if Chrome wants to do it. He's already showing you a little bit of that jumping up and down thing. Let me at him. Let me at him. I want to keep him from going back to the other cattle. It gets to be hard to ride, just like the kids get to be hard to control at Disneyland. It's time to go to work. So I'm going to ride in now. And as they say in the world of competition, I'm going to cut a cow. And I'm going to see if I can keep this cow from going back to the other cattle with my wonderful horse, Chrome. Nice Chrome is his full name. And I think I better hold on to this horn because I believe he's going to be a little bit difficult for me to ride if I'm not careful. Now I have two, so I have to support one and not the other. I have to keep the one out and not the other. Oh. What was that? And that, oh! Mm. 
Wow! Holy moly, holy, holy, holy. So, that was just a little warm up. <laughs> okay. So now I'm going to cut another one and we're going to get a little more seriouser at this point in time as they say in the cutting horse world. This is getting seriouser. Now the cattle are starting to relax a little more, that's good. Because I want them to roll back and leave me with this one right here. Look at him jump up and down, up and down. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Look at him jump up and down, up and down. Uh -huh. Does he love it or not? Has he been caused to love his work instead of demanded from? Or not. Oh. Good boy. Good boy. He said it was time to quit right there. So we'll quit that one and we'll get another one. I'm not reining him. I'm not telling him to do this at all under any circumstances. This is his gig. What a birthday present. I didn't believe he would do that well. I'm so proud of Chrome and his working a cow. And I'm 86, but I'm having fun. And what a birthday present Chrome has given me.